Johnson & Johnson is committed to making life-changing long-term differences in human health. We do everything we can 24-7 to provide those with serious and persistent mental illness the home, health, and hope they need. We want to be able to do right by them, make sure that they have productive lives and that we get good outcomes. So we, we know that integrated care is the best way to achieve that. We are serving patients who are among the neediest and most vulnerable within our community and we're very proud of the work that we're doing jointly. This is a story of a special place that helps people stay healthy and lead good, productive lives. Some of them are young. I really like my doctor because he understands me. Some are older. We have a Zumba, we have yoga, we learn how to keep healthy. Compassionate, knowledgeable, old-time care, and you just know you're going to be taken care of and most require care that exceeds their resources or insurance, if they have insurance. But none of that matters at Zufall. All of them, some 30,000 a year, get quality care from a team of physicians, nurses, and other professionals who are passionately dedicated to improving the lives of others. It's mission that drives both Newbridge and Zufall to uh, join forces to improve the health of persons with persistent and chronic mental illness. It's sort of building on our collective experience on how to work together with our community organizations and our partners to, or in order to provide the best care for our patients in our community. We wanted to improve access for that group of folks by bringing services to them where they were receiving mental health services rather than uh, forcing them to somehow come to our sites. Our, our motto at Thresholds is home, health, and hope. And that's what we do. We do everything we can 24-7 to provide those with serious and persistent mental illness the home, health, and hope they need. The vast majority of our workforce works in the community, on the streets, at homeless shelters, at the hospitals, at the jails. Wherever people are, we go to them. People with serious and persistent mental illness uh, historically have not come in for services. Uh, and we know that, and while we're trying to change that to some extent, uh, by building integrated healthcare clinics and more services on site. I recognize the need in our community. Uh, there's a lot of people that suffer from mental illness and there's a lot of stigma out there. Um, there's a lack of understanding where it comes from, um, how it's developed, what treatment options um, individuals have, and um, the prognosis for it. Integrated care has been a benefit for my patients and my ability to have real-time consultation with their primary care provider impacts uh, them in many ways. Of course the obvious uh, impact is to reduce illness, but there's other consequences. So many of our patients have very limited funding or they have no money at all and their ability even to get to the clinic for care. I would want to thank you for giving me back a life, a life of purpose and meaning and hope that I feel so, I am so grateful to have found the center and I feel that the, you all have saved my life, literally. And now I do have hope for the future where before there was none. And so what we will see from an integrated model is a benefit to um, not only the healthcare system, but to individuals and to communities. It will increase access to services, and it will also help with stigma associated with behavioral health challenges by looking at the person in totality and not just one aspect of them.